orbit beyond the blue. James Webb has done it again. Astronomers using the James Webb Space Telescope have discovered evidence of complex organic molecules similar to smoke or smog in a distant galaxy. This is the oldest known example of complex organic molecules in the universe found by humans. And what it has done is that it has pushed back the old record for detections like this by about an extra billion years. I don't know about you, but to me, it is fascinating and at the same time terrifying that these discoveries at the edge of the universe are changing the foundation of our cosmology. This is a mighty discovery. And here is what it changes. Okay, first things first. These chemicals have been detected within an early galaxy that formed when the universe was about 10% of its current age. The carbon-based molecules, technically known as polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, are found in oil and coal deposits on Earth, as well as in smog. But what is the significance of this finding? Justin Spiker, lead astronomer of the study, makes it very clear that the molecules we found aren't simple things like water or carbon dioxide. We're talking about big, floppy molecules with dozens or hundreds of atoms in them. Isn't it remarkable that the universe could make really large and complex molecules very quickly after the Big Bang, when our models suggest that they couldn't have? Given the extreme distance of the galaxy, the light the astronomers detected began its journey less than 1.5 billion years after the Big Bang. The universe is currently about 13.8 billion years old. We are looking at the beginning of the formation of the universe as we see it today. But here's the catch. It is because of Webb that we have been able to detect these complex organic molecules pushes back the old record for detections like this by about an extra billion years. Imagine if we could look farther back in time. Is it possible that we find more of these molecules, and that too, extremely close to the Big Bang? Where does that leave our science, our cosmological model? Now here's the thing. Previous efforts to detect complex organic molecules in ancient galaxies could only tell if the chemicals were there or not. With Webb's resolution, we can now see actual details of where within a galaxy the molecules are located. In this early galaxy, called SBT041847, the presence of these molecules is not uniform, and the reason for this remains to be explained. Also, this discovery proves that it is possible for galaxies to form in the early universe where much was thought to be happening. What is fascinating, however, is that the galaxy was already just as massive, and its stars have formed just as much carbon and oxygen as our own Milky Way, even though it's only a tenth the age of our galaxy. It's like a third grader who's already lived an entire career, gone to college, accomplished a career's worth of work, and then retired at age eight. With the way Webb is performing, it is only a matter of time before the universe shines in a new light. But then again, what do I know? Orbit. Beyond the blue.